Okay, so we're off at the Sam Manx Park now with uh, Sue Ann uh, Pickford Spencer, and uh, she is uh, one of the candidates for the town council election. And uh, how are you today? Not too bad, Steve. Yourself? Good. Beautiful one. Oh, it is. And it's a good idea to do this all at the park. Just like summer starting. Oh, yeah. It is, isn't it? Okay, so let's uh, get to the first question, and that is, tell us a little bit about yourself. <sighs> well, my name is Sue Ann Peckford Spencer. Uh, I'm originally from uh, Southbrook Halls Bay. Uh, I've been working in the tourism industry for approximately uh, 17 years, 12 of those uh, in uh, Burgio. Uh, I have a diploma in travel and tourism hotel restaurant management, a diploma in business administration, and I'm also a heavy equipment operator. Okay. Number two, why are you running for council and what will you bring to the table? Uh, I've always wanted to take part in uh, uh, municipal uh, politics, but I really never ever found my calling uh, until I uh, moved to Burgio. And uh, really up until the last five years, I really found my calling here. Um, First of all, uh, I listen to the people of the town and uh, they believe there's not enough being done for the community itself. Uh, Burgio needs a voice, uh, so I bring myself uh, to the table. Okay. Number three, if elected, what are some ideas you may want to put forward? Um, my vision for the town would be for uh, the town council, uh, government officials, uh, organizations, and especially uh, the people of uh, Burgio uh, to uh, welcome opportunities. We need to boost tourism. We need to uh, increase economic uh, development, uh, which would create a larger tax base. Uh, we need to boost our tourism big time with brochures, maps, our museum should be brought forward. It should be our focal point of the community. Uh, and we also need a seniors complex, which is desperately needed in the town of Burgio. Okay, perfect. Regarding the ongoing water situation, what do you want to see happen with it? <clears throat> uh, water situation. Well, first of all, I believe that the town should fix its problems with the leaks. And I'm not really up on the water situation to say too, too much about it uh, until I get elected and have a look at it and then I can speak to the people. Uh, but I can tell you this, that I do not believe in water meters. Uh, that's one thing the town has spoken very clearly on. Uh, so until I get, if get ele elected, I'll have a look at that then. Okay, perfect. Number five, regarding the declining population in the town, what can we do to increase it? Jobs, we need jobs. Uh, whether it be aquaculture, uh, whether it be the building of a seniors complex, but create jobs. And uh, once uh, I get on council and you can work with government officials and see what kind of opportunities are out there for the town. Good, perfect. Um, number six, what are your thoughts on the waste management? Uh, I like the waste management pro uh, project. Uh, I believe that uh, Earth has been a garbage dump for a long time. Uh, the pr it's a bit pricey, and I'm not sure if uh, the facility that we have there, if we needed something that extravagant, but we've got it. Uh, and like I said, it's a bit costly. Uh, and uh, in regards of uh, uh, the citizens of Burgio not knowing exactly what's going to happen, if elected, I will make sure that uh, the citizens of Burgio uh, know how this recycling depot operates. Okay, perfect. Number seven, recently the town has been working on an agriculture project. How do you feel about this? Well, you already just uh, briefly. Well, it seems to be the way of the times. Uh, it's it sold a lot of coastal communities. 50% uh, of uh, fish in the world now are being farm raised. Uh, one thing, though, I would want our waters uh, to be farmed with care. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So now number eight, why should people vote for you? So here's your chance to give you a little speech, son. Good question. <laughs> this is the hardest one. Yeah. Uh, I feel I have the passion and determination mm -hmm. to set a plan uh, for future growth and development of the town of Burgio. 
Uh, I have an open mind. I'll listen to the people and the community. Uh, I think I can make a difference. Just give me a chance on the 26th. Thanks. Perfect. Thank you uh, so much for the interview, and good luck in the election. Thanks, Steve.